so this is part two of my solar water heater experiment on the roof. So I've made some modifications from my first iteration based on things that were and weren't working well. Um, first thing I found out is these uh, salvage solar panels that I had weren't generating enough power for the small pump. So I went on Amazon and for $89 I bought a 50 watt solar panel by Renology. I actually bought two of them because they seemed like they were a good deal. They were less expensive than the 30 watt models. I've got one hooked up to the pump and I've got one that I haven't hooked up yet. Ultimately I think it's going to be to charge a battery for some lights or just to have some power affiliated with just the shower area. Um, the next thing I realized is that the panel, the, the, the hose, um, was not at the right attitude for the sun. So what I did was I had to put some backing on this. I just put three boards across the back to hold everything in place. And then I took a uh, shelf bracket, two shelf brackets, and I put some two by fours essentially on them that stick out to give me a little bit different angle for the solar water hose, the thermal solar collector uh, at this time of year in the summer. In the winter time, I have the option of just tilting it back into place. I also covered it with polycarbonate. I would have preferred a sheet of polycarbonate, but it was about three times the cost as one sheet of polycarbonate roofing material, which was $25 or thereabouts. Originally, I had put some salvage polycarbonate on it, but even though I cleaned it, it was so dirty that I thought it was, um, it was blocking the UV radiation. And I thought for the purposes of this experiment, it was worth another $26 to get a brand new sheet of polycarbonate. So that's the front of it as it stands right now, going through the garden, just to show you the back of it. And I'm not even sure it's finished yet. Um, still have a little bit of leak in the hose. So this is the little pump that's being driven by the solar panel. You're gonna feel it, you can feel that it's working. And that hose is warm, that hose is warm. I guess this is the direction of the pump. It's less warm on this side than it is on the other. Um, and that's just clipped into the back of the solar panel here directly, so it's a direct drive. So we'll see how it works, see if it works a little bit better.